Hey guys. 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 Hey I guess what I would want the public to know is that everything, every animal that lives here is as loved and cared for as every animal out there, if not more. And that there's people like myself and Tama who We'll do whatever we have to do to make sure that these animals are as healthy and safe and cared for and loved as possible. A couple pieces. So, so it's all sterile. Huh. Is there any Basic questions to understand how diseases are caused and prevented and most especially treated? Uh, requires at some point in the process of research questions that have to be addressed in an integrative way, meaning the whole body. And typically those types of questions require that we do do some studies in laboratory animals. And laboratory animals are bred for research purposes uh, so that we can control um, everything to do with them. All the research that we do do that requires a whole animal to understand those questions follows very strict federal guidelines and policies, not just for the use of the animal in the experiment, but for their care to assure that they have minimal pain and suffering and that we derive the most information we can from any given experiment to try to reduce the number of animals required for research. But the reality is, is that to get at questions that are really important for you or me, uh, and before, for example, a drug would come into humans, uh, we have to do some studies that require animals in those experiments uh, to understand their safety, how they work, do they hit the target that they're supposed to, what kind of dose might we need to give. Uh, all these basic questions uh, that are applicable to human disease and therapy. I was looking for the lighter color. Yeah, that was yeah, that's what we were looking for. These little white things sometimes you see in there, those are what we call, those are to give them something to do.